नमस्कार यू आर अगेन वेलकम इन ऑनलाइन क्लास फॉर मैथमेटिक्स ऑफ टेंथ क्लास एज वी आर रीडिंग इन दिस चैप्टर टेक्नोमेट्रिक रेशियोज एंड क्वेश्चन डिपेंडिंग ऑन टेक्नोमेट्रिक रेशियोज फॉर डिफरेंट वैल्यूज ऑफ द एंगल एज वी हैव डिस्कस्ड अबाउट सॉरी अप टू क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी As yesterday, today we will discuss question number twenty one and question number twenty two. As the remaining part of exercise six point one, the first we have to focus on the question number twenty one. What is given here is given that if x is equal to thirty degree, then we have to prove that first one. The first part is sine three x is equal to three sine x minus four sine cube x. And second part is tan 2x is equal to 2 10x upon 1 minus tan square x sin x is equal to root of 1 minus cos 2x that is divided by 2 and the fourth part of question number 21 that is given as we have to prove cos 3x is equal to 4 cos cube x minus 3 cos x as we can see in the given question number 21 here all the parts given as Part number one, two, three, and four are the standard formulas of trigonometric functions. At least we have to we have to try to remember all the parts as given in question number twenty one. All are the important formulas of trigonometric trigonometric chapter. Okay, these all are the important part. You have to remember all one as we will discuss it later. At if you are unable. to try it so if you are unable to remember then we have first we will study and then you have to try to remember okay then first we are discussing question number 21 part number first given as question number 21 given x is equal to 30 degree then first part prove that first part prove that prove that sin 3x is equal to 3 sin x minus 4 sin cube x okay then first we will take any of the side as given as lhs or rhs here first i am taking the side lhs okay by taking lhs by taking lhs and lhs is given as sin 3x and we have to substitute the value of x and what is the value of x is given it is given that x is equal to 30 degree then we have to replace x is equal to 30 degree in the question then we will obtain it as sin and 3 is multiplied by x and what is the value of x that is given as 30 degree that's why we can say the value obtained as sin 90 degree and from the table we can see what is the value of sin 90 degree that is equal to 1 it is taken as equation number 1 and second part by taking by taking rhs and what is given in rhs rhs is given as 3 sin x minus 4 sin cube x okay first we have to substitute the value of x at as it is uh, here is given x is equal to 30 degree then we will replace the value of x in the given part of rhs here we will substitute x as 30 degree then here we will obtain 3 sin 30 degree minus 4 here sin we can write sin cube of 30 degree in the next step we can write 3 sin 30 degree and here we can write as 4 into what we can see here here the given terms is as sin cube 30 it means we can write cube of sin 30 then first we have to put up the value of sin 30 degree and what we know by uh, seeing in the table we can see what is the value of sin 30 degree that is equal to 1 by 2 as we know 
3 into that is given as 1 by 2. Okay, sin 30 minus 4 into what we can write? Here we can write sin 30 as given as 1 by 2 means cube of 1 by 2. In the next step we can write 3 by 2 minus 4 into cube of 1 that is given as 1 and cube of 2 that is given as 8. 2 into 2 into 2. Okay, in the next step we will obtain 3 by 2 minus that is 4 by 8. As we can write 3 by 2 minus 4 by 8 it means 1 by 2. And by taking L, LCM as 2, here we have 3 minus 2, that is we have 2 by 2, that is given as 1. Okay, and from this is the equation, assumed as equation number 2, then from equation, equation 1 and 2, we have LHS is equal to RHS. Hence proof, you should write down. The next part given as Second part, what is given? 10 to x is equal to 2 10 x and that is divided by 1 minus 10 square x. Okay. First by taking by taking Rx sorry LHS and we have LHS is equal to 10 to x and here we will substitute the value of x as 30 degree. Then we will get as 10 2 into 30 that is 60 degree and as we know what is the value of 10 60 that is equal to root 3 equation number 1 again by taking by taking RHS and we have RHS is equal to 2 10 x that is divided by 1 minus 10 a square x ok then we have to substitute the value of x as given as 30 degree then we will substitute how we can it is here 2 10 30 degree that is divided by 1 minus 10 square 30 degree again we we will rearrange this as rhs is equal to 2 10 30 degree and here we can see in the denominator part we have 1 minus square of 10 30 it means we can write a square of 10 30 Okay, next part, we have to substitute the value of 10, 30. As it, we can take the value from the table and we have the value of 10, 30 from the table, it is given as 1 by root 3. That is divided by 1 minus, it is 1 by root 3, square of 1 by root 3. That is given as 2 into 1, 2, that is divided by root 3, that is divided by 1 minus square of 1, that is 1, square of root 3, that is 3. Okay, it means we have obtained 2 upon root 3 that is divided by 1 minus 1 by 3, we will obtain 2 by 3. It means we can write 2 upon root 3 and the denominator part is taken as reversed. That means, it means 3 is taken as numerator part and 2 is taken as denominator part. We can see 2 is cancelled by this 2 and 3 is cancelled by root 3 that is here we can write root 3 it means RHS is also root 3 equation number 2 from equation 1 and equation 2 we can see LHS is equal to RHS we have to write down in the next question question number 3 Part number 3 given as sin x it is equal to root of 1 minus cos 2x that is divided by 2. Okay, first we will take by taking by taking LHS and LHS is given as sin x and we have to substitute the value of x as sin 30 degree sorry 30 degree that's why that's why we can obtain sin 30 degree as we know what is the value of sin 30 degree that is equal to 1 by 2 okay equation number 1 in the next part by taking RHS and we will obtain RHS as given as root of 
1 minus cos 2x that is divided by 2 and we have x is equal to 30 degree as given in the question. We have to substitute the value of x in the uh, RHS then we will obtain RHS as equal to 1 minus cos of 2 into 30 that's why that's why it will be 60 degree that is divided by 2 it means we have RHS is equal to root of 1 minus what is the value of cos 60 degree and we know value of cos 60 degree is equal to 1 by 2 that is divided by 2 it means we have root of is 1 by 2 means 1 is subtracted sorry half is subtracted from 1 that's why we will obtain 1 sorry 2 1 by 2 and that is divided by 2 again we can see here we can arrange it 1 by 2 into 2 it means we have root of 1 by 4 and we can write as a, uh, sorry, root of 1 that is equal to 1 and root of 4 that is equal to 2 equation number 2 and we can see LHS is equal to RHS it means we have LHS is equal to RHS both sides are equal in the question that's why hence root Next part, part number 4, we have x is given as 30 degree and we have to prove that fourth part and fourth part is given as cos 3x is equal to 4 cos cube x minus 3 cos x that is given and by taking first we will take one side then I am taking first by taking LHS and LHS is given as cos of 3x okay what is the value of x it is given as the value of x is equal to 30 degree and we have to replace the value of x inside the side and side is given as cos 3 into 30 it means 90 degree as we know cos 90 degree is equal to 0 that's why we have LHS equal to 0 equation number 1 and by taking by taking RHS and we have RHS is equal to ok see here what is given RHS as 4 cos cube of x minus 3 cos of x that is given and what is the value of x value of x is equal to 30 degree first we have to replace the value of x inside the given side and side is given as RHS that is equal to 4 cos cube of x and what is the value of x that is 30 degree minus 4 into what is the value of x that is 30 degree the cos 30 degree the next we will obtain what we can write cos cube of 30 degree that's we can write is cube sorry cube of cube of cos 30 and minus here cos 30 degree 4 cos 30 degree in the next part we have to substitute the value of cos 30 degree as we know RHS is equal to 4 into what is the value of cos 30 degree that is root 3 by 2 root 3 by 2 then cube of root 3 by 2 in the next step we have 4 into root 3 by 2 okay then again in the next part 4 into okay we will rearrange the given terms as I am making some changes here I will write here root 3 what is the power of root 3 that is given as 3 it means we can write root 3 4 3 times into root 3 and into root 3 and that is given as 2 to power 2 into 2 into 2 minus 4 into root 3 that means 4 root 3 that is divided by 2 again in the next part we can write here 4 is cancelled by 2 into 2 4 and we have root 3 into root 3 3 it means we have 3 root 3 that is divided by 2 minus here we can write okay there is some change here not given as 4 that is given as 3 here again 3 and I have written some uh, wrong terms okay here again 3 
and here again 3. And we have 3 root 3 that is divided by 1. And we can see this term is completely cancelled by this term. That's why we can write 0. It is, this equation is taken as equation number 2. And we can see by equation number 1 from equation 1 and 2. We have LHS is equal to RHS. That's why, that's why we can write it is given, sorry, it is proved. It means hence proved. You should write down. Okay. As we have discussed question number 21 and all the four parts we have discussed, first you have to remember, try to remember all the parts because these are important formulas of trigonometry. Okay. Again question number 22 as given, it is again the important formula of coat. We have to try to remember or we will study later in the chapter of trigonometry. The next part okay question number 22 question number 22 given as given a is equal to 60 degree and b is equal to 30 degree and we have to prove prove that cot a minus b is equal to cot a cot b plus 1 that is divided by cot b minus cot a okay first we will take one side from the given sides as given it is taken as lhs means left hand side it is taken as rhs and it means it is at the side of right hand side okay first i am taking by taking by taking lhs and here LHS is given as LSS is equal to cot of A minus B. And here given as A is equal to what is given? A is equal to 60 degree and B is equal to 30 degree as we have. In the next part, next step, we have to substitute the values of A and B inside the side. Okay. Then we have cot of 60 degree minus 30 degree. And by subtracting 30 degree from 60, we will obtain cot of 30 degree. This is the side as LHS. It means we have LHS is equal to, what is the value of cot 30? As we know cot 30 is the opposite function of tan 30. That's why the value of cot 30 will be root 3. This is taken as equation number 1. Again, by taking, by taking, RHS as we have RHS is equal to cot A cot B plus 1 and that is divided by cot B minus cot A and we have to substitute the values of A and B and here we have A is equal to 60 degree and B is equal to 30 degree ok then what is the obtained values in RHS as cot 60 degree into cot 30 degree plus 1 that is divided by cot 30 degree minus cot 60 degree. Okay. We have to substitute the values of 10, sorry, cot 30 and cot 60. Okay. What is the value of cot 60 degree? As we know, value of cot 60 is the opposite of tan 60. That's why we have 1 by root 3. That is multiplied by cot 30 degree. And what is the value of cot 30 degree? That is equal to root 3 plus 1. That is divided by cot 30 degree. It means we have root 3. And minus, what is the value of cot 60? That is given as 1 by root 3. Okay. As you can see here, root 3 is cancelled by root 3. That's why we have only 1 here. Then 1 plus 1 is remaining also. And here we can write as we can take LCM as root 3. And root 3 is multiplied by this root 3. That's why we have root 3 into root 3. That's why we have 3 minus 1 that is divided by root 3. Again we can see here 1 plus 1, 2. That is divided by, that is divided by 2 upon root 3. As we can see 
this part can be inversed that's why we will we have 2 into that part is taken as numerator part and this will be denominator part and we have 2 is cancelled by this 2 that's why we will obtain root 3 as taken as equation number 2 from equation number 1 and equation number 2 we have LHS is equal to RHS okay as we have completed the exercise 6.1 now I am giving you some examples based on trigonometric ratios. You have to solve all the question at your home and uh, at least try to solve. Okay? If any question you are not uh, solving, you are getting some problem with the question, then you can ask me directly by commenting in the comment box or okay. Rest part I am giving some important questions you have to write down. Okay, write down some questions. You have to try to solve at your home question. Some questions. For homework, yes, directly I can write homework. Homework. Question number one, we have to find if theta is equal to 45 degree then 1 minus cos 2 theta that is divided by sin 2 theta will be equal to second question as I am giving prove that prove that sin 60 degree is equal to 2 10 30 degree that is divided by 1 plus 10 square 30 degree ok second part cos 60 degree this is the first part this is the second part cos 60 degree is equal to 2 cos square 30 degree minus 1 and third part we have cos 60 degree is equal to 1 minus 10 square 30 degree that is divided by 1 plus 10 square 30 degree question number 4 sorry question number 3 we have we have to prove sine 45 degree plus ok this question is left left again the question has given as 4 10 30 degree prove that ok these are the parts as prove that Know that question number 3 it is given as 4 10 30 degree into sin 45 degree into sin 60 degree into sin 90 degree and that is equal to root 2 ok in the next part if question number 4 if cot theta is equal to 1 by root 3 then prove that prove that 1 minus cos square theta that is divided by 1 sorry 2 minus 2 minus sin square theta is equal to 3 by pi that is the more important question you have to try to solve okay question number 5 Question number 5, prove that, prove that we have 4 into sin 4 of 30 degree plus cos 60 degree minus 3 of cos square 45 degree minus sin square of 90 degree is equal to 15 by 4 that we have to prove question number 6 again prove that
cos 30 degree plus sin 60 degree and that is divided by 1 plus cos 60 degree plus sin 30 degree that is equal to root 3 by 2 and the last but not least question question number 7 we have to prove 2 into cos square 45 degree plus 10 square 60 degree minus 6 into sin square 45 degree minus 10 square 30 degree and that is equal to 6 ok I am giving you 6 sorry 7 questions as given and the sorry on the board and uh, here all the questions you can solve in the question first cos if theta is equal to 45 degree then we have to find the values of this function second one we have to prove 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 ok in the question fourth we sorry question number third there is no doubt you can directly uh, substitute the values of trigonometric uh, ratios and again you, you can find the on other side ok but question four it is important because cos 30 degree is equal to 1 by root 3 that's why first we have to think about theta what is the value of theta as you can see cos theta at which value of theta cos theta is equal to 1 by root 3 we can see theta is equal to 30, sorry 60 degree ok if theta is equal to 60 degree then we have to prove 1 minus cos square 60 degree upon 2 minus sin square 60 degree is equal to 3 by 5 you can easily solve it as we are getting theta is equal to 60 degree then directly substitute the value of 60 degree in the, inside the given uh, side LHS and again you can prove LHS is equal to RHS again question number 5th there is no doubt because all the values we can substitute from the table there is no doubt question number 6 and question number 7 ok then this chapter is completed tomorrow we will discuss uh, we will start the next chapter ok if you have any doubt you can solve at your home again if you have remaining some doubts then you can ask me ok thank you